Here in this Geddes home lives Pritchett Donnelly. For ten years she had been the tax collector for the town of Geddes. Each year she would balance the $7 million tax roll. But that part of her job was just the icing on the cake for Pat, who found the job rewarding in other ways. The people, to meet all the people, I think, that came into the office to pay and had questions and needed help. and It was really rewarding to meet all my neighbors and guest residents. Pat was diagnosed with non-Hodgkin's lymphoma, a diagnosis that at first terrified her. She found the treatments to be a challenge, not only physically, but mentally as well. I mean, it was okay because a lot of people supported me, and um, especially Amy, my daughter, Amy. With the support of her friends and family, Pat was set on fighting her disease. She had many incentives to stick with her treatment, but one was the clear front runner. I think, and my, my granddaughter, Kylie, was my incentive. She was an infant at the time. No cancer free is living the good life, often providing daycare for the not one, but two granddaughters that she used to fear not being around for. It's kind of a gift. Yeah. <laughs> really. <laughs> it makes you think about it even now, five years away. It makes me still think about how fortunate I was and how, um, how what a gift it is to, to be here, you know. Has survived her diagnosis, but now makes the most of her life. A life that was already filled with laughter and family, now tempered by one of the hardest tests life can offer. Tests that she has passed with flying colors. Paul Turner on TV News.